Subscribe to join our family for more updates. Healthy life to you. Listen carefully to the testimony of Colonel Sanders. When he was five years old, he lost his father. Sixteen years old, he decided to leave school. At seventeen years old, he already lost four jobs. When he was eighteen years old, he decided to get married. When he was between 18 to 22 years old, he grew up railroad superintendent but he did not do well and he was expelled. He later joined the army but was expelled as well. He applied to law school but was unsuccessful position. He became an insurance agent but he failed too. Finally, he got a job as a cook and a was Harman small restaurant dishes in the United States. He tried to fight to find his son who he had left with his mother but failed and decided to convince his wife to return home. At the age of 65, he retired from his job as a cook washing dishes in the restaurant and after retired, he got his benefits from the government partially of 105 US dollars, approximately shillings of Tanzanian 2031 shillings at the moment. After seeing life has become very difficult, he made a suicide attempt believing it was worthless of living again and that he has completely failed. Fortunately, his suicide attempt was unsuccessful and he was healed. After a while, he decided to sit under a tree and to write the things that he wanted until then he may have succeeded in doing it, but he thought he should write it what he had already completed. He realized there was he hasn't done many things yet. Later he asked himself a question, what's the matter with this, which I could do better than anything that in my life. He realized there was something one that he can do better than anyone who knows him, and it was like that of cooking. He decided to take 87 US dollars equal to Tanzanian shillings 100,091 and 400 from the his pension check and buy chickens. He fried them by mixing them with spices variety and got a combination of his kind interesting. He decided to go from house to house and sell them to his neighbors in Kentucky when he was leaving. His chickens were very popular and decided to start his own restaurant called Kentucky Fried Chicken KFC. Kentucky Fried Chicken that you grew up making the chicken mixture he designed. Eventually his business grew and he opened many KFC restaurants in the United States. The combination became more popular and expanded the scope of his business. This is none other than Colonel Harlan Sanders, the founder of KFC restaurants in the world. Despite to retire as a disposable pauper at the age of 65 years, but until he died in 1980, at the age of 90 he became in the list of the biggest billionaires in the United States. Currently, KFC restaurants are spread all over the world in about 123 countries, including Tanzania, and the second largest restaurants in the world after McDonald's restaurants. In 2013, KFC restaurants made sales of $23 billion equal to 1 trillion Tanzanian shillings 50. What this means is that KFC's sales to one year is almost twice the budget Tanzania for the year 2016 2017, remember, the founder was Fukara until his old age, 65 years old, and thought he had failed in life and attempted suicide. But after thinking he saw he still has a chance to try again. He tried though in old age, and finally God he succeeded. 
He became a very big billionaire in the United States. Have you given up on life? You wished study but failed due to lack of fees. Have you studied but are unemployed? Years go by you see your spouses are employed, you are alone at home. Have you tried business but always are you just getting lost? Feeling hopeless. You feel it has God left you. No, don't give up, God has not abandoned you. Regroup and start over. You are not late yet. The big thing is your attitude. No matter how difficult things are, you have everything to make you successful. Decide to change your perspective. You are here today to change the history of your life. It's possible. Start now. Any idea you have, any dream you have, you can start living it successfully as you will decide that it is possible. Don't accept the situation what you experienced in the past should be an obstacle to success your tomorrow. Live your dream, remember the dream yours is possible, health life to you, don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel for more updates, Lupomo TV is a mine of knowledge.